put your kitchen scraps in this basket. And it, the science is you can't be any longer than three feet. If it's four feet, which I've done one that was four feet before, that last foot dries out. It's amazing. That's so the what's the formula, Deb? Formula for... What's your... It's a six-foot diameter keyhole garden. Six-foot diameter circle with a keyhole to access this. The basket for kitchen waste is exactly one foot in diameter and one foot higher than the finished wall height. And what's going to go in that basket? Kitchen waste, anything. Kitchen waste, grass clippings, not twigs, but stuff that munches down its water. Because grass clippings and kitchen waste are 90% water. That's your water. Now you can put soapy water in here. That stuff's great. Coffee grounds. Coffee grounds, paper, newspaper. Oh my gosh, I put t-shirts in here. T-shirts? So anything, no. anything I, you I put might put, cotton, cotton almost cotton. anything you might put in a worm garden. Anything that's organic. In a worm bin. Mm -hmm. Anything organic. It, cotton. Uh, oh, you are going to town over there. Look at the volume of this. I mean, that's why this is such a prolific garden. It's going to be great soil, and it's a volume. You know, for your tomato plants to have to make it through the volume down there is a little different story.